Man, I love this game so much, I just wished Barack or Donald would play with me. Hey, Joe, it's... What the hell am I looking at right now? Oh, hey, Barry, it's been a while. Joe, don't dodge the question. Just why in the world are you playing that piece of shit? Don't be hating on this masterpiece, Obama. This right here is what true gaming is. No, the hell it's not, Joe. If you want to know what actual gaming is, jump over to my stream so I can show you what a real game is. Nah, I'm trying to get my favorite character from this banner. I already spent over $400, so hopefully I get her this role. Okay, this game is dog shit. Joe, please tell me you were joking when you said that you spent over $400 on Genshin Impact. Actually, it was more like $800, but I don't want to think about that, so let's just move on. Yeah, I think that's for the better. Well, let me start up the game. Wait, aren't we going to wait for Donald? I don't think we'll be seeing Donald for a bit with his 37 charges. I heard he was secretly sent off to prison, and that's where he's been staying since he got charged. Wouldn't the news already report it? With how Donald's cult followers are, I'm surprised they haven't tried another January 6th. They were extra careful not letting this slip to the public. I hope Donald is okay, though. I really don't care what happens as long as I get my second term. But knowing Donald, I bet he bribed some of the guards and is now living in some secluded area in the prison. Probably. Okay, how about if you sneak me in some McDonald's, I'll give you a 30% discount on my golden Donald Trump shoes. Signed, of course. Mr. Trump, for the last time, this type of behavior is not tolerated and could get you into more trouble. Look, I'm a fellow Trump supporter, but you really have to follow the rules. Man, fuck the rules. Look here, Steve. Everyone outside is against me, and you may be the only one who may actually be on my side. But if I have to eat one more vegetable from this prison, I will die. <sighs> Let me see what I can do. Thank you, Steve. Now for my second favor is to let me have some alone time in the showers. The last thing I want is for Big Tyrone to show me how he quick time events my ass. I don't know about that, Mr. Trump. The best I can do is to put more surveillance on you. Well, unless you slide me a tip, then maybe I can do something for you. Of course you ask me for money, but as long as my ass is safe, no price is too big. So, how does six dollars and some loose change sound? You gotta be fucking joking. Ah, peace and quiet. I knew that Steve guy was smart. Now I don't have to worry about Obama's cousin sending loaded missiles to my ass. Now where did I put the soap? Man, I gotta be more careful where I put the soap at. If this was with everyone else, my ass would have been cooked. Thank God for Steve saving my- Hey there, pretty boy. You're gonna pick that up, right? Around here, we don't like wasting soap, so I suggest picking that up. Please, man, I can get you whatever you want. What I want is for you to pick up that soap. I'm getting excited if you know what I mean. My anaconda is waiting, orange juice. Well, at least I won't hear his annoying ass voice for a while. True, now I have one less dumbass to hear. Come on, Barack, I know you don't mean that. Joe, you're as useful as a wet paper towel. You're saying when you know damn well I carry us on duos. And you're forgetting that you fall asleep midway through the match, causing us to lose. I have no clue what you mean when you say you carry when you fall asleep mid-match. I'll prove you wrong, Obama, just you wait. Whatever, right now I need to focus up on this combat. I'm a bit rusty since we had to quit the Batman Origins run. Wait, we played Origins? Not surprised you forgot. We had to quit because your dumbass decided to piss on Donald's PS3 thinking it was a toilet. I still don't know how you mixed a game console in a fucking toilet. Oh, I remember now. Yeah, some voice in my head told me to piss on Donald's PS3 to save our lives or some shit. Then how about you listen to the voices outside your head when you do some stupid shit like that? I don't know, Obama. That voice sounded urgent. Then take those pills you get prescribed, Joe. It can make all those imaginary voices in your head go away. Man, those pills taste like absolute ass. That's why I just use my new USB stick with the chocolate chocolate chip flavor installed. Shit wakes me up better than the pills could ever do. USB? Are you vaping, Joe? Do you have any idea how bad that is for your health? Shut up, Obama. You're not my mom. Your old ass is definitely not making it four more years. Like you know anything about being President Obama, your black ass could never get elected. Joe, you racist old bastard. Did you forget that you were my VP for eight years? I swear that dementia is getting worse and worse each year. Wait, I was your VP? Uh, oh, I remember now. Yeah, how could I ever forget something as amazing as being under your wing, Obama? 
Just like that one time when you and me stripped naked and Joe, shut the fuck up. Be able to support my weight if I grab up to them. How many times do you hold? Keep away, or this little piggy fries. Only one hit, lame-ass boss fight. Joe, he's just to show the player how to use the takedown mechanic. He's not a boss. Yeah, I can see that with how easily he went down. I bet I can take him on a 1v1. Can you hear me? Is this thing on? <laughs> Jesus, Joe, calm down or I'm kicking your horny ass from the call. My bad, Obama, but Harley just unlocked something in me. I may need a new change of depends. Christ, I would expect this type of reaction from Donald, not you. Sorry, I'll try to hold back whenever she shows up. You better. For now, we have to chase after the Joker. Hopefully he has something more than just some Joker goons. Goon? I heard my son goons around with his furry friends. Sometimes he invites them to our house, but they always carry big boxes of something. Your son is a freak, and so are you. Come on, man. <laughs> There's no escape, Joker. I will find you. Ooh, I'm counting on it. Just not yet. Joker always pulls the most out-of-pocket shit from nowhere. But that's what makes him such an entertaining villain. I don't know, Obama. I think he's a misunderstood villain. You did not just say that. Yes, I did. Joker was a regular person like me and you. I don't think being older than the sun counts as normal. Shut up, Barry. But he then was forced into becoming a criminal, the Red Hood to be specific, and joined up a gang to get enough money for his wife and unborn child. Joe, you do know in that same scene he tells Batman that he himself doesn't know if that's what happened. Joker got hit with the Biden dementia and was probably just spouting random shit to catch Batman off guard. I still think he's misunderstood. <laughs> this right here, folks, is what happens when Donald eats his 80th Big Mac. Or when your crackhead son snorts up that high-grade white snow. Leave my boy alone, Obama. He's just a little special is all. Yeah, he's special, all right. Special in the head, that is, just like you, Joe. Fuck you, Obama. Is this rat man ever going to escape this place, or are we just going to be stuck here? Because this is getting boring. If you can't even focus on a game for this long, then I have no fucking clue how you'll do in the presidential debates. Don't worry about me, Obama. I've been cooking up some fire-ass responses. You should be more worried about Donald. His ass is about to get cooked. That better be true, Joe. This may be your last opportunity to show the country that you're not incompetent. Or you can take my advice and drone strike Yemen, like how you did with that dad getting water for his family. Jesus, Barack, you really need help. Maybe some skibbity toilet or digital circus can calm that crazy mind of yours. How about you watch some more age-appropriate shows? I'm glad that your old ass is somewhat playing age-appropriate games, with the exception of absolute shit impact. Please don't mention that game, Barry. I feel like crying with how much time I spent on it. Luckily, I got a new game to replace it already. Is it Batman or a new open world game like Tears of the Kingdom? Nintendo has been on a roll lately. I'm not a kid anymore, Barry. I have outgrown Nintendo. No, the game I'm talking about is Honkai Impact the Third. Bruh, that's legit the same game. No, it's not Barack. The story is fascinating and... Keep it in your pants, Joe. I don't want to hear about that weeb shit when we were playing Batman. Fine. He's got your father. Dad. Don't worry, I'm getting him back. Man, I wish Oracle was still Batgirl. I really wanted her to show up in those tight spandex. I do still wish she was Batgirl. Those suits squeeze in all the right places. I knew you would understand, Barry. Maybe we have more in common than I thought. Yeah, the only thing is that I'm talking about the adult version we see in the Arkham universe, not the kid version, you fucking pedo. Shut up, Obama. Don't go acting like you haven't peaked at Nightwing's wagon. I can't even lie. Man has a glorious ass that will make anyone tweak out. The difference is that Nightwing is an adult. Arkham Asylum is now under new management. He is a quick update on what's going on. Some idiot is running around the asylum dressed like a bat. I know! Okay, this should be the last part, and after this, we should be able to explore Arkham Asylum. Finally, I was about to fall asleep with how uneventful this game is. You have zero room to talk, Joe. Now, how about we talk about that debate that's coming? Is there going to be a camera in Donald's cell, or are you going to free him? Oh, right. Um, I don't know. They can just put a bag of Cheetos on his podium, and it would be like he was there. 
as funny as that would be, you should really free him? Or do you not want to use those fire roasts you quote unquote cooked up? Mm, yeah, you're right. Maybe I can convince some guards to set him free, but only that. I'm still not pardoning him from his other charges. Bet we can have Donald play with us next time. Maybe he'll have some prison stories he could tell us. Like how he got to eat three times a day instead of 46. I doubt anything he says will be entertaining or be worth paying attention to. You never know, maybe his pumpkin ass got put to work. Doubt it. All right, this should be good enough to end it. Oh man, just when it was getting good. Well, we can continue playing when Donald gets set free. You really want me to free him? Fine, I'll see if I can do anything. Then I'll see you later and good luck beating the Sleepy Joe allegations. I just hope Kamala doesn't get too mad.